Okay, we're back for another one. Um, hopefully, we're going to be able to find out where to drop this load and pick it up and all that. Now, I was on the little add-on thing I did. It was on the cargo market and couldn't figure out how to find the load. Right? So I sent him a message and uh, see what happens. But then I went into the external market. And external market will pick up loads at your location. See, I'm at the Walmart budget in uh, where am I? I don't, in Victoria, Texas. And there was a load going to Dallas, but not quite Dallas. So I wouldn't pick up Dallas. I would pick up Waco on the way through, but I wouldn't pick up Dallas. I would have to go to Dallas to actually pick up that on the discovered list. But they do have one going to Lufkin, Texas. So I can begin delivery. And we're going to Lufkin. Lufkin, Texas. I know somebody lives there. Uh, I know somebody lives in Lufkin, Texas, believe it or not. In real life, not in the game. And um, so, yeah, that's where we are, folks. We are going to go to Lufkin, Texas with a load of empty pallets. It is now 12.16 p.m., after lunch, or during lunch, I guess, for some people. And um, it's, uh, I want to say it's about a four-hour drive, maybe. Something like that. And then we will uh, spend the night in Lufkin. And then we'll see what we Let's get coming out of Lufkin. To skip loading the trailer and start the delivery, press enter. Let's press enter, because I'm not doing all that. Okay. okay, so here we go. We now have a loaded weather well, loading the truck. Now it's 105 p.m. And now we're ready to go to Lufkin. Oh, you might hear a lot of truck in this one. I don't know. I'm going to do a lot of talking. I do wish they would put those things back on the ground instead of trying to find it on the GPS. But that is aggravating. Here we go. Going to Lufkin, Texas. I have never, in real life, I've never been to Lufkin. I do know someone that lives there. As I said numerous times. Turn left. Why do I keep hearing sirens? I didn't do anything. I was framed. Stay left, and then turn left. Okay, first of all, we have to turn right before we turn left. Another glitch.
and we're off to Lufkin, it'll be 4 hours and 31 minutes. We'll be flying at an altitude of about 6 feet. Go straight. I see a left turn coming up for me, so... Stay right. This is what I was saying in the last video, that you can pick up more than one city on a trip. Because we just have to drive through Houston, and hopefully, hopefully we'll hit that sweet spot where we discover Houston, and we don't have to actually stop or find that particular place where it is. I've been to some cities, and you really have to drive through the city uh, to find it. You can't just get within the city uh, limits. You have to find a particular spot on a particular street. And so I don't know how they're doing this one. Turn left. Put our four so we see the traffic light. I say go to four because it's number four on the keyboard. I have never seen that before where you turn left onto a highway that way. Uh, must be a Texas thing because I've never seen that before. I mean, you turn left onto a highway, but not like that. Usually it's at the traffic light and you turn left or something. This one, yeah, this is a little different than I'm used to. It's all good. It all works, though. I'm on the road where I need to be and everybody's happy.
My speed limit is 75. This truck is set for 65. I don't know why. Um, it's not set in the settings that way, but it is. it has a limit of 65 on it. So that's why we're going 65 and not 75. Please pull in for an inspection. That's what I did. I by, I'm trying to bypass the scale. They even have Porta Johns here. Isn't that cool? I mean, that's some real, that's some real thought going to this, into this uh, game. Have a safe journey, 74,952 pounds. Almost bypassed though, didn't we? I went to the right and I didn't realize they didn't have a scale on that side. Houston discovered another one off the bucket list. We're now at number eight. Lufkin will make number nine. That will leave us 20 more cities in Texas. Wow. It's nice to have dreams. <laughs>
stay left. I keep hearing sirens in this game, but I don't see any, like, where I'm getting a ticket or anything. That's weird. Usually in the other version, I don't, I don't remember hearing that unless it was me that was getting a ticket or speeding or whatever. Ran a red light or whatever. It's different. That's why there's so much noise. The window's open. Okay, didn't realize that. Wow, wonder how many times I got wet and didn't realize it. Window was open. Lufkin, an hour and 21 minutes, but I saw the sign. I knew that bus was going to pull in front of me, so I hit the brakes a little bit there.
stay right and then exit right. Exit right. Lufkin discovered, okay. Twenty more to go. You know, the most difficult part of that is not discovering the cities as it is trying to find loads going to that city or where you pass through that city. That seems to be more difficult than maybe being able to discover the city. Stay left, and then turn left. Turn left. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. And we are there, folks. We just hit that little sweet spot now. Maybe that's, nice what, oh, maybe that's what that diamond is here. Yep. Okay. Uh, no, you know what? We're just going to go ahead and drop it here. Okay, so we have nine cities out of the way. We have 20 more to go. 
I did see the little triangle thing on the ground this time, which I did not see on the other one. So maybe that's uh, an improvement. Maybe. Okay. Now, if we wanted to haul something out of here, for instance, we could go to the external market. And you can pick it up at the same location where you know you can't. Okay. External contracts. Let's see what that one is. No. So apparently the other one. Okay. Well, anyway. I don't know. Maybe I thought I knew what I was talking about, but apparently I didn't. Okay. We could go Lufkin to Tyler. And I believe we're probably about through for today, but. We could probably do Tyler. We could get up to Tyler, which would give us uh, about 8 o'clock tonight when we're done. 8, 9 o'clock, something like that. Or we could just shut it down and say, you know what? It's been fun, and that's it for today. Oh, that's a Galveston. Oh, my gosh. Ooh, that would be a good one to get. It has to be delivered by 2 8, by 2.30 a.m., Tomorrow. Oh, no. no. I would love to go to Galveston because there are not a lot of loads going to Galveston. Um, okay, well, anyway, that's where we are, folks. We have a bunch of stuff going on here. Uh, that's where we are. And we will see you on the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. And if you don't like the video, give it the thumbs up. Hit the thumbs up button twice. And, um... Don't forget to hit the notification bell, and we will see you on the next one. See you when we see you.